Okay, everybody, I know this doesn't sound, look like art class, but I thought we'd have some more fun. This week, remember, we're talking about color. That's the next in the series of the elements of art. Remember, we did, had this project uh, first, and we did the dots, um, calling pointillism. And I thought, okay, that was fine, but I'm getting hungry and it's getting close to lunchtime. So I thought, okay, let's focus on color again. And I'm going to make myself some lunch. So I pulled a whole bunch of things out of my refrigerator and my pantry. And remember this bowl, we used it to trace um, the circle uh, for the pointillism project. So I'm going to make myself a uh, lunch. I'm gonna start with red. So I've got, let's see, I've got some Twizzlers. I'm not sure I want that in my salad. So I think I'm gonna reject that, sorry. I love these, oh, by the way, these are cinnamon too. Um, but I'm not gonna put them in. I am, on the other hand, going to do some strawberries. So I'm gonna cut some strawberries. That's nice and red. Normally I cut a little nicer than that, but I don't want you to spend too much time. I'll bet you're getting hungry, right? So that's my red. Now blue. Um, I have blueberries. Oh, Jolly Ranchers too. I got those. Um, again, cinnamon. You guys know I like cinnamon. I'm rejecting those. So blue. Um, I've got blueberries, but I'm going to call those purple. So the only other blue food that I have was... Um, this uh, Gatorade, which I keep in the uh, fridge downstairs for my um, godson. And so, ugh, I'm not sure how I feel about this, but I'm gonna put some blue in there. Maybe just a little bit, cause that's scaring me. But there's my blue. And then yellow. So I've got um, a lemon and I've got a banana. And oh, by the way, do you see how this banana is still green? <laughs> That's because I'm not sure I want to put this green avocado in my fruit salad. So I'm going to reject my avocado and I'm going to cheat a little bit. And I'm going to say this yellow banana is going to be green. So I'm going to open my banana and I've got some of that. That'll be my yellow. Um, also, you'll notice what I did was I got some olives out. Um, again... Oh, these are jalapeno stuffed olives. Um, my husband liked those. I'm not putting these green olives in my fruit salad either. Sorry, not gonna happen. I know you guys wish I would, but it's not gonna happen. Ooh, I do have maraschino cherries. So maybe I'll throw a couple of those. These are cherries, but you know, <laughs> I don't know how good they are for me. Also, I have craisins. Those are red. Oh my gosh, I have so much red food in my house. So I'll put a little bit of those in. So I've got um, my red. I've got my yellow and green. I know I'm cheating my um, bananas. I'm gonna put purple in. All right, ooh, watermelon. I hope you like watermelon as much as I do. This is a uh, melon baller, so I'm just gonna get some watermelon in there. Absolute favorite uh, fruit in the summertime. I could eat this all day, every day. As a matter of fact, this one's going in my mouth, sorry. So there you go. Oh, more strawberries. Now, also you guys know do you remember that I am a beekeeper? And every year in the late summer, early fall, we harvest honey from the hives. And so this is my orange. Um, it's really very, very delicious and it's exceptionally sweet as well. So I'm not sure how much of this I wanna put in, but you know, heck, I'm doing it anyway. So there's my honey. So, there is uh, my color theory for this afternoon. This might not be something you wanna do the first day. You may wanna to go to the grocery store or send um, somebody in your family to the grocery store to go get some foods to make your um, 
color project of fruit salad, or it doesn't even have to be fruit salad, it can be something else. I'll squeeze some lemon juice in there too. So did I forget anything? It doesn't look as colorful as I wanted it to be. Um, but there you have it. This is my lunch. I'm wondering what colors you're gonna use to make your lunch. Good luck and have fun with it.